Welcome! In this video, we will explore the Dynabool feature of the Mudkit plugin for Autodesk Mudbox. Using the DynaSkin feature, Dynabool provides a set of Boolean operations that can increase your creative flexibility. Using relatively simple objects, or combinations of objects, you can quickly create complex geometry that would otherwise be difficult or time-consuming to sculpt. Dynabool is best used in the early stages of your sculpt, when you are shaping and refining a low to mid-resolution base mesh. When your base mesh is complete, you can then use Mudbox's existing retopology tools to create an appropriate topology for the next stages of your process. Let's take a look at how to use Dynabool. Dynabool offers three Boolean operations, union, difference, and intersection. Each operation requires two objects, object A and object B. In all cases, object B is imposed on object A, resulting in a single DynaSkin mesh. As with all Dyna tools, the density level of the resulting DynaSkin mesh is controlled in the Settings section. To begin, select an object and add it to either the object A or object B slot. Then add a second object to the remaining slot. Once both objects are added, you can then click the button for the desired Boolean operation. The union operation combines object A and object B into a single DynaSkin mesh. After adding object A and object B to the Dynabool section, you would then click the union button to fuse the objects together into a single DynaSkin mesh. The difference operation subtracts object B from object A. Please note, you can combine several objects into a single object for use with any of the Dynabool operations. When object A and object B are in place, you then click the Difference button. In this case, you will see that the combined object B has cut into object A. The Intersection operation creates a single DynaSkin mesh from the area common to object A and object B. As before, once object A and object B have been added, you would then click the Intersection button. Here, the resulting mesh is from the area common to both object A and object B. By default, Dynabool replaces your identified objects A and B with the new Boolean DynaSkin mesh. If, however, you would like to keep your original objects, you can uncheck the Replace Source Object setting. When unchecked, Dynabool will hide and lock your identified objects A and B after reskinning, preserving them for future use. The Dynabool feature relies heavily on OpenVDB to achieve its results. OpenVDB is an open source C library originally developed at DreamWorks Animation and is now maintained by the Academy Software Foundation. This library is freely available. If you would like to learn more about OpenVDB or would like to download the C library for your own use, please use the links provided in the description below. Thank you for your interest in Mudkit. I hope the Dynabool feature will add value to your workflow. Mudkit is completely free for you to use. However, if you like it and it adds value to your workflow, please consider buying me a coffee. The Buy Me a Coffee link is in the description below.